Okay, so Rajesh is asking a very good question that for those patients who have endotracheal tube or tracheostomy tube in place, to prevent the pressure necrosis by the cuff of these tubes, whether we should intermittently deflate and inflate the uh, uh, cuff of these tubes? So the answer is no. Reason, two reasons. First, if the patients are connected to ventilator by the endotracheal or tracheostomy tube uh, in such patients, it will cause the air to leak from the side of the tube and you will not be able to ventilate these patients properly. Secondly, if the patients are connected to ventilator or not on ventilator, but they have endotracheal tube or tracheostomy tube in place, deflating that uh, cuff at regular intervals will can cause aspiration pneumonia. Reason? Because from the oropharynx or pharynx, there happens micro uh, aspirations because the secretions went down from these to the trachea. And the cuff seal prevents them from getting trickled down to the base of the lung. Even if we do suction uh, before deflating the cuff, some amount of secretions trickle down to the base of the lung. And if we do it frequently, it can land the patient in aspiration pneumonia. So rather than inflating and deflating the cuff at regular intervals, we should check the pressure of the cuff at regular intervals by the cuff pressure manometer and we should keep monitoring it. So I hope it clarifies. Do read more about it. Thank you.